So it's going to be part two of DIY tuning for max horsepower on a ZX6R 636. So I have a 2013 model. Uh, before I start, please like and subscribe to the channel. I'm going to cover a lot more of the tuning of Z, my ZX6R. I also have a ZX10R and a GSXR. All of them I use Woolwich Racing software to tune. All of them I either track or ride on the street. Um, so these tunes are track proven. And just take a look at my ZX6 on some of the uh, like south or north or even road Atlanta. It accelerates and runs very well. I'm 240, 250 pounds, so it's it's got a lot of weight to get going. All right, so with that said, this is part two. I'm only going to cover the fuel maps and show you what a year or so of auto tune has done or how, where it set it. If you want to see my auto tune map, I have created another video on my channel. I'll just search for it. It's um, Basically, I show you my auto tune map and where I set it. But to not, for this, I'm just going to go over the fuel maps. All right, so blue is rich, red is where it's leaned out. And this is the manifold pressure, basically up to about 15% throttle. This is the map that's used. After 15% throttle, it blends into the TPS map. Also remember, according to the dot to the settings video yesterday, in the configuration that I have my transition set thirty percent with Woolwich software, that doesn't necessarily, I believe, write the program into the ECU for that, but it's the way Woolwich will populate populate the map is what's done. I'm not one hundred percent sure on that, so. That's something a question for Woolwich, but like I said, I choose 30%. Also, as previously mentioned, blue is rich, red is lean. One thing I want to do point out is over here is not your idle. When you have the bike idling at 1200 RPM or 1300, you are not on the far left of the screen. You're actually in this area right here where there's red is. This is actually the area that you'd be in when the bike is idling. All right, um, another thing that I do, I wanna show you this is, so 15.4, 100% throttle. I try to get this, let's see how it is. I try to have this readings over here closely match TPS readings. Well, they're blended, but it's not as close as I thought they would be. But that's just something I try to do because essentially TPS, IAP, zero manifold pressure, this is essentially the same thing as 100% throttle right in here. TPS is the main map used at 100% throttle, actually about 15% is what I've been told or the common understanding. Uh, you can see at idle, if used, you are at 0%, 0.3%, somewhere in here, actually in here for your fuel settings. But this map is not really used at idle. It's the IAP map, so I'm just showing you that. But I do want to show you that these are my fuel settings, basically, for my bike. And this is with... 09 12 stacks, MWR air, air filter, and a full exhaust. So you can see it's actually leaned out some here from factory and richened up some as you climb up in RPMs. All right, so I'm going to cut this video short. I didn't want to go into a lot of detail. I just wanted to show the fuel mats for ZX6R. After a year of auto tune and applying it, and what you end up with, uh, like I said, my mods are full exhaust, MWR air filter, ZX, I mean, 09012 velocity stacks. So, anyway, I'm going to cut this short. Hope you enjoyed it. Like I said, please like and subscribe if you want to see more.